Our question is Jo, who will be three on Halloween. Sometimes is overtired during the day. Are you tired today? Yeah. Yes. Should we reintroduce his daytime nap, which we haven't had since the beginning of the year? Or do we bring his bedtime forward? It's very hard to keep him up past seven o'clock. <coughs> So yeah, age three can be really tricky because some are ready to stop napping, whereas others still need some sleep in the daytime until they're closer to four, even four and a half. So if this little one hasn't been napping for a long time in the day, there probably is some built up over tiredness, but we're now approaching three and there's a good chance that that nap would be on the way out anyway. So reintroducing it at this stage is probably not the best move. Um, by all means, allow catch-up sleeps. If he nods off in the day, let him sleep. I wouldn't disturb him. If you're out and about, he nods off on the go. He needs it, so I would let him have that sleep, but I wouldn't enforce the nap now if he's not used to doing one. I absolutely would say yes, go ahead with the early to bed. Early nights are gonna be key right now because the length of the day is probably a bit too much for him. So if we're not gonna get asleep in the middle of the day, then we need to sort of chip a bit off the end of the day and make bedtime earlier. A lot of parents would be fearful of doing an early bedtime because they're gonna worry that going to bed earlier is gonna mean waking up earlier the next morning, but it doesn't work that way. And in fact, actually, if this little one's continuing to go to bed too late and is overtired, the night sleep will be worse. So getting to bed earlier is good. Um, definitely asleep by 7 p.m. at the latest, and if he's ready to go to sleep even earlier, that will be fine too.